Hello, hello, beautiful people. Welcome back to a brand new video. And today we are finally going to start going for 99 Slayer on our main account. As you guys know, I'm slowly working towards maxing my main and my Iron Man at the same time. Well, it's about time that we get this 99 Slayer out of the way. Now, the reason why I'm doing this right now is because there is also a new Slayer monster that came out to the game Basilisk, and I want to be experiencing a lot of the new things as well. So we're going to go ahead and, you know, just do a bunch of tasks, hopefully get some Basilisks in the process, perhaps get that phase guard. It's currently going for about 20 million and just all in all have a bunch of fun. We're going to start it off killing aberrant specters so let's go ahead and do that also i'm lagging a little bit because i'm currently rendering a video so that doesn't really matter let's go ahead and do our first task i'm gonna keep it very very short after every task i do i'll probably price check some loot and then just keep doing a bunch of tasks so it's gonna be a slayer packed episode so hopefully you guys will enjoy 570k from 144 gargoyles next task is gonna be some scorpia let's get three 10k from three scorpions and the new task is gonna be Dagonoffs and you know what since we have that new cave Why not give it a shot and see how it feels to cannon them in this area? I would hope I can set this up. Are they all melee? Yeah, I don't see any range attacks So it appears that they're all melee. So that makes this even easier All right, so the verdict are these good are these bad compared to the ones in the lighthouse? I think these are a bit worse I do get 75k an hour XP here though in Slayer, so I'm not quite sure how much I get in the other Dagonovs. But the next time I get the task, I'm gonna go ahead and give it a shot and then I can compare both. Uh, but still, I do think these are worse. Uh, I haven't gotten anything useful to pick up. Um, the random drops come up to be for about 40k uh, and the task is nearly done. I think I have like 3 left. Fire Giants completed, if I picked up all the loot it would be about 100k and we get some Adamant Dragons. Adamant Dragons, 110k, new task is gonna be some Steel Dragons, why am I killing so many dragons? 78k, 105k from 8 Mithril Dragons and the new task is going to be Basilisks, which is really awesome, let's hope for a jaw. We got ourselves the first superior basilisk, 4.7k experience, and the drop was a rune axe and a couple of runes, 200k in the first trip, another superior basilisk, 4.7k experience again, and a bunch of runes, 276k from trip number 2, 211k from trip number 3, and 111k from the last trip. 241 Necreals, one of the best tasks in the game. Trip number 1, 350k. Trip number 2, 240k. A lot of you guys started watching my videos when I started my Iron Man series. The other people started when I started my Deadman mode series. But either way, there has been like a lot of people asking me where are my Iron Man videos. And the truth is, I'm kind of still playing it, but I'm doing very, very slow things right now, such as agility, such as farming. And if we price check all of the herbs that I've farmed basically while I play my main, while I do Deadman mode stuff, I have over 44 million worth of just harvested loot pretty much and all of those after 99 farming i'll then convert into the potions and uh, that should pay for 99 herb lore so that's what i'm doing right now as you can see i have a bunch of secondaries a bunch of supplies just wanted to show that 95 farming in this video and i guess let's continue with the main progress 280k from the next trip and just one more trip to go and for the last one we got ourselves 341k i forgot to do it in the past but we can now unlock a basil longer for 100 points and well obviously we're gonna have more basilisks when we do get assigned them so that's pretty cool fire giants task completed for 52k 16 black dragons i'm just gonna do the small ones because i'm low on points and the new task, once again, 10 Mithril Dragons, very quick, very easy. 56k from only 10 Mithril Dragons, and we also got ourselves Chewed Bones. Now, I'm not gonna be burying one at a time, when I get about 10 of them, we're gonna go ahead and burn them in Barbarian Pond place thingy, to go ahead and try to get ourselves a, um, I think it is Dragon Full Helm. Um, I'm gonna do it when I have 10 of them pretty much, so it's gonna be more interesting that way. We've completed Dark Beasts and now we get some Gargoyles for a grand total of 619k, one of my favorite tasks by far. Oh, and Dust Devils, very, very nice. 336 from that one, absolutely loving Dust Devil tasks. 
We got ourselves a first Dust Devil Superior. Let's see if we get something from this one. And we got ourselves Dark Totem Top. 370k from the last trip. And since this is my 349th task in a row, I'm gonna go ahead and grab the new tasks from Konar. Uh, and uh, he or she will actually give me more points per completed task. So let's see what we get from Konar. Three Rune Dragons. We only killed three rune dragons and we got 100k for them. That's kind of crazy. New task, five mithril dragons. And as you can see, for doing that task with Konar, we pretty much doubled our points. We got 300 of them for just completing that one task. I just completed the Suqua task and ended up not picking up anything. And the new task is going to be some Dark Beast. Ended up getting about 20k from that task. And the new task, as you can see, is some crazy archaeologists. 10k from those three kills. And the new task is going to be some gargoyles. Very nice. Another superior gargoyle. And this one is also the last kill of the task. So let's pr quickly price check the loot. And the loot comes out to be about 630k, which is very, very nice. And for the new task, we're gonna be killing 134 blood welds. Insatiable blood weld coming through. And we only got an insult head and some blood runes. And here we have it. With this blood weld, we will be achieving 97 slayer. And well, with that level, we now only have two more levels to go. To have 99 slayer and that has been a goal for me for so long and if i were to combine all of my accounts that i train slayer on i would have many 99 slayer accounts but believe it or not i do not have a single 99 slayer on any of my accounts i have 97 on iron man 97 on main i've had 95 many times on deadman modes but not a single time have i completed the full goal of finishing 99 slayer and well that will change in the very near future i'm absolutely loving the skill and i'll focus a lot of time and effort into actually completing 99 slayer okay a little bit of in real life update in the last video i uh, mentioned to you guys that i uh, will be moving and well this video was almost fully recorded in my new location already now unfortunately though the internet speeds are horrible here that makes it so i can't stream which uh which sucks because uh, if you guys know me streaming has been pretty much a day-to-day -day routine for the longest of time i've been streaming every single day for the past three years pretty much sometimes i take a couple of days off if uh, i were to visit my parents or if i had to do some health related stuff but mostly if i could i would stream every single day for the past three years now that's changed in the last two weeks or so um obviously a lot of stress when it comes to moving and then right now i'm obviously living with my parents for a little bit longer so that really makes it not so easy to like play the game and record stuff that you want to record and uh yeah i mean a little bit of a stressful situation right now um nonetheless i'm gonna do my best to obviously upload as much as possible for you guys and uh, i will also start uploading fairly frequently to my second channel uh, because i do want to post a lot of other stuff that are not strictly runescape related and if you made it this far in the video i want to ask you something how would you react if i were to post a non runescape related video to this channel would you unsubscribe would you just not click on the video what would you do i really need to know because this is the thing that's been like dragging me back for so long i want to upload so many different things um but i'm afraid because i do not want to lose subscribers i don't want to ruin what i've been building for so many years and obviously i'm a little bit scared because of it so definitely let me know what you think and a worst case scenario i'll post to my secondary channel and uh you know that's also fine uh, so if you guys want to check out what i do outside of runescape definitely feel free to check that channel out currently there's about 200 videos there that you can enjoy pretty much you know for free and i would seriously recommend you to to check it out um it's obviously mainly league of legends related there's some other games as well there though and uh, i definitely think you can find something enjoyable for you to see there too but yeah that's pretty much a very quick in real life update for those of you who care and uh yeah i really hope you guys did enjoy the video i say that so many times so much but uh it really does mean a lot all the support that you guys show 
even when I, uh, you know, just leave for a little bit of time. But uh, hopefully the, the, the pace will pick itself back up. Uh, there's like leagues coming fairly soon, hopefully. So that's obviously going to be a lot of content. And uh, well, unfortunately, there, there's no Deadman mode coming. But um, I mean, we can always go back to Deadman mode and maybe do some more series on World 45 or anything like that. If you have any suggestions for video ideas, let me know in the comments. Um, and uh, yeah, that's going to be it from me for today. I'll, uh, I'll be back with another video fairly soon. And uh, yeah, I'll see you around. Have a good one. Peace.